Hi everyone, my name is Bruce Wartz. I'm from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. I'm doing research on the moon, beautiful 14 inch telescope that this magnificent community raised for this channel research. And we're finding UFOs. We've uh, confirmed we, we are finding structuring, what looks like construction. I mean, how can it not be? Uh, some amazing close ups, guys, in this video. Absolutely amazing close ups. This is three or four videos up today. I'm spoiling you guys. You gotta be careful of that. Now, can I? But you guys are spoiling me with the support and uh, flowering me with all of your um, kind words and support. And it's what makes me thrive, guys. It's what makes me wanna continue this research and basically what makes this research so pleasant to do. Uh, a lot coming up in the coming days. Um, I'll be up all night because I have a lot of videos that I want to prepare for tomorrow. We're going to get in really close. Why not? Let's really get in close. And then uh, not far down the road, we'll be using that 46 megapixel uh, D850 new Nikon camera that I got for the channel, guys. Five thousand dollars four thousand four hundred and fifty dollars i believe exactly with the taxes and that's without a lens there's so much we're going to be able to do One hundred twenty thousand iso so it's going to be pretty amazing um bringing out the detail it's pretty scary because we're going to be seeing double the detail and then i'm going to apply my technique to that and we'll see what we can do guys we're always getting better and better and at a quick pace, you know, we're all impatient because obviously we just can't wait to find out what's up there, but we're seeing a lot. We should be very grateful uh, for that. I'm grateful for you guys. Thanks for all the generous contributions. Please listen till the end of the video. Um, a bunch of people, three in particularly, Russ, Nigel, and Char. Guys, I love you so much. Thanks so much for the generous support. I got a message for you guys at the end. Please listen up. I'm going to get some music up and shit up right now. And another great video. This one is a real good one, guys. Um, I'll get some more up for you tomorrow. Thanks for the support. Oh, yeah. By the way, at the end of the video, you're going to see, uh, well, near the end, a UFO. Two of them, the ones that arrived at the outer edge of the moon on the east side that I caught. You'll see it closer and clearer than ever. Always working on the UFOs. And for those who haven't seen it, well, you're going to really enjoy it. Thanks for watching, everyone.
You ever wonder why Earth has a blue line around it? Well, they say it's oxygen. But why does the moon have a blue line around it? Could it be parts of oxygen? Could it be that the moon has an atmosphere higher than what we were told it has? John Lear, retired CIA agent, told us that he thought the moon had an atmosphere higher than what we were told up in the 70s of, of percentage of atmosphere. I definitely believe it. This is Copernicus Crater. And lo and behold, there is a UFO, a bright light, whatever it may be, just beautiful, coming out of the side wall of Copernicus Crater. Isn't that beautiful? And as this is coming out of it, whatever it is, whether it's something natural, whether it's exhausting, there's that train again every time I'm making a video. Sorry, guys, about the train, but he's just happy I'm posting these videos. That's why he's tooting his damn horn. <laughs> All right, so guys, um, check this out. UFO, yeah, both of them arriving on the outer limits of the moon on the east side, an illuminated sky that, um, you know, it illuminated the whole east side. This is pretty incredible. Looks like there was something launched on the surface, some type of projectile. There is definitely something going on up there, guys. And we're looking at this, um, peeking through the veil, looking at little uh, events, well, little events, big events that are happening. And look at this, able to capture this. And, you know, thanks to you guys, the news is getting out a little bit. But, I mean, the world should know about this. So let's try to get these videos out. Thanks for sharing, everyone. First of all, I really want to thank everyone for the support. Russ Baker, Nigel Banford, Char Gordon. Guys, uh, first of all, hey, Russ Baker, thanks so much for contributing, bro. Welcome to the community. Nigel Banford uh, says, keep up the good work, Bruce, and greetings from the United Kingdom. I love you, Nigel. Thanks so much, man, for connecting to the channel, for checking out the research and for being a part of this community. Char Gordon says, sorry, Bruce, this is the only way I can do it, little by little. Keep up the amazing work, Bruce. I look forward to every video you put out there. Char, I want you to know that coming here, you say little by little. I mean, you guys, don't you guys dare have to defend yourselves for giving me what you guys call little amounts. No freaking way. These aren't little amounts. Char, I greatly appreciate your help, all of you, all of your help for these magnificent amounts of help. And 
It's thanks to you guys that this channel is up.